Good morning, here with Legacy Flower and Sheet Metal. Today we are in Bayfield, Ontario. A pretty unique job. We have a, a trailer home we're gonna do. A nice thing about trailer home, they're pretty straightforward. We do have some venting and stuff to, to deal with. We have some stick outs, and we did warn the client, if we're gonna do the stick outs, the trailer home can no longer, the stick outs can't move in. So we'll show what it looks like later. This is going to be a peel and stick system, so there's gonna be no fasteners through the roof whatsoever. You're really gonna like it. Come on, join us, thank you. Okay, welcome back. We've come up on the roof. You can see the red dye. That is the primer. It's simply the glue that's going to adhere the base sheet to the existing membrane. So we have, these are washroom vents. We have some air circulation vents. We've took off the cap just to kind of expose it. We need to make sure it's waterproofed underneath, not just to the actual cap. So that's ready to go. The stick outs are getting roofed in and we have an air conditioning unit that we have to roof in place. So there we go. Um, we are priming it. We're getting the base sheet cut and ready to go. And we're going to have some metal flashing detailing around the skirt around the outside. We'll show you what it looks like. Thanks a lot. Okay, welcome. Legacy Flat Roof and Sheet Metal. We finished the job. The job turned out great. I think the client's going to love it. The great thing about this product, we even had the opportunity, well, we had to leave it overnight. We applied the cap sheet, left it overnight. There was some rain overnight, but still all the leaks that she had before were all sealed up. She didn't get a drop of water, which is actually a good testament to the quality of work, but also the product we're installing. It's a good product. Anyway. There you go, Legacy Flat Roofing Sheet Metal. We went from a single ply um, PVC roof to a two ply mod bit roof. In, in Canada, with the hot summers and the cold winters, you really get a lot of um, uh, expansion and contraction. So in my opinion, a two ply system is always gonna be better than a single ply. We had a couple vents to deal with. We, uh, this is a trailer, so she had a few stick outs. So really, this detail in the stick out was very important to us because we had to make sure driving rain and water didn't get in. This isn't the best watertight detail when it comes to when the, when the trailer gets to the site because it has to move open and close, so it's very difficult. Um, now we watertight it, we put a flashing so driving wind and snow won't hit this detail. There we go, we, we roofed in the air conditioner, a couple bathroom vents, and really gave the client a beautiful roof she's gonna enjoy for a couple decades. Legacy Flower of Gunshima, we had a great time doing this trailer. Hope you liked it, hope you learned something. If you're in the southwestern Ontario area, we'd love to hear from you. You can find us online at LegacyRoofs.com. Thank you so much.